Hello, I'm Philip Stoughton for ID People. I'm here at Wise Media's sixth EMEA Summit in Abu Dhabi, and I'm joined by Fausto uh, Lugo Garcia. Thank you very much for joining me. You're from, welcome. Uh, Mexico City government. Um, you're going to be speaking in a short while about um, EID and security in the in the city. Yes, that is a, a big project that we implement in Mexico. We install 8,000 cameras. We put in operational five uh, command and control center and one C4. That is uh, to improve the, the life of the citizens, mm -hmm. to improve the operational in terms of security. And the most important is to be prepared to react in case of major crisis in the city. Right. Mexico City have a, a lot of uh, natural disaster impact, earthquakes mm -hmm. uh, to, to be the most important. And, and the design of the C4 helped us to, to react and to prevent some, some major cases right there. Yeah. So we implement the project at the beginning of the 2008, and we start working a lot with the human resources, the technology, and probably the most important is to, to improve all the days mm. in terms of the security. Okay, and is it a, it's a private and public partnership? So it's no, no, it's, it's, it's totally, it? totally government okay. that invests in the solution and improve all the security. Mexico, in the, as the country, have a, a lot of issues in terms of security, but Mexico City have a better place in the world yeah. in terms of security. And in terms of the importance of security, I, I, I know from, um, for example, the electronics industry, security in the country as a whole is an important element to getting, it, getting investment into the country. That, that is really important because uh, part of the investment that there is made in, in the country is related to the uh, tourists, mm. to the different kind of companies yeah, and industry. obviously if we, if we provide security is obviously better better place to, to, mm. to go there. Yeah and it's one of the most populated cities in the world it's very dense but you also have a um, big variation in terms of income in terms of uh, wealth of, of the citizens. Does that present its own challenges? Of course, that is uh, part of the solution. Uh, the safer city uh, need to be part of the social programs mm. uh, because you need to, to have the same layer of the uh, social uh, relation. Uh, so uh, the the program that we started in uh, 2000 uh, improve the, the the better life mm. uh, and better income for the yeah. citizen. If you uh, take these objectives as part of the security, it really, really impact. Mm. Uh, and you need to prevent mm. in, in terms of uh, another issues that you present a risk in terms of, of the crime. Yeah. You need to, to put money in the, in the young people to, to put in action in terms of education, in terms of integration to the society, you don't make these programs to to nivel yeah. to have the same level. Obviously, you have a disruption right there that's probably compared to the crime. Yeah, and it, it's also, I, I guess, from a point of view of having those areas of the city that people don't go to or people are particularly afraid of means that there isn't investment in retail, investment in leisure in those areas. And if you can open that up. Uh, Actually, we have all the, the same situation in Mexico City. Mm. We are not having the, the same songs as the uh, last year ago. Okay. We improved the security mm. right there. We obtained the space, the public space, to the government property. We, we made uh, some programs that obviously change, or take off the, yeah. the, these spaces to the crime. Okay. And take our as a responsibility, and obviously it's a space for the public uh, solution. Okay, so that creates a much a much healthier environment of for product. everybody. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Well, thanks very much for talking to me. Thank you. You're for your welcome. Time. I look forward to your presentation. I hope it goes well. Thank you. Thank you very much.